in this session we discuss the exercise problems on locus exercise on a first problem find the equation of locus of a point which is at a distance phi from a 4 comma minus 3 let us solve this problem now we have to find out equation of the locus which is at a distance of phi units from point a 4 comma minus 3 now here suppose given point say a that is 4 comma minus 3 the point on the locus say p x 1 comma y 1 join a p the distance from a to p is 5 units so that means given a p is equal to 5 using distance formula a p can be written as root over x 1 minus 4 whole square plus y 1 plus 3 whole square equals to 5 squaring on both sides. So, we get x 1 minus 4 whole square plus y 1 plus 3 whole square equals to 5 square. Now, this can be written as the value of x 1 minus 4 whole square equals to x 1 square minus 8 x 1 plus 16. Now, the value of y 1 plus 3 whole square plus y 1 square plus 6 y 1 plus 9 equals to 5 square means 25. Again, we write x 1 square plus y 1 square minus 8 x 1 plus 6 y 1 adding these two numerical terms that is 25 equals to 25. So, x 1 square plus y 1 square minus 8 x 1 plus 6 y 1 25 minus 25 0. Therefore, the locus of p x 1 comma y 1 is in the place of x 1 replace x in the place of y 1 replace y. So, we get x square plus y square minus 8 x plus 6 y equals to 0. Find the equation of locus of a point which is equidistant equidistant from the points from the points a minus 3 comma 2 and b 0 comma 4 
Now, we have to find out equation of the locus which is equidistant from the given two points a minus 3 comma 2 and b 0 comma 4. Now, here suppose let us draw a figure like this say p x 1 comma y 1 this point is a minus 3 comma 2 this point is b 0 comma 4. Since p is equidistant from a and b, so distance from p to a, distance from p to b are equal. So, we write p a is equal to p b. Using distance formula, this p a can be written as root over x 1 plus 3 whole square plus y 1 minus 2 whole square. Similarly, p b can be written as root over x 1 minus 0 whole square y 1 minus 4 whole square. Now, this is root over x 1 square plus 6 x 1 plus 9 plus y 1 square minus 4 y 1 plus 4 equals to root over x 1 square plus y 1 square minus 8 y 1 plus 16 squaring on both sides. Now, we get x 1 square plus y 1 square plus 6 x 1 minus 4 y 1 plus 13 equals to x 1 square plus y 1 square minus 8 y 1 plus 16. So, now this x 1 square x 1 square gets cancelled y 1 square y 1 square gets cancelled bring minus 8 y 1 plus 16 this side 6 x 1 minus 4 y 1 plus 8 y 1 plus 13 minus 16 equals to 0. So, this is 6 x 1 plus 4 y 1 minus 3 equals to 0. Therefore, the equation of the locus of p x 1 comma y 1 is 6 x plus 4 y minus 3 equals to 0. Find the equation of locus of a point P such that the distance of P from the origin from the origin is twice the distance distance of p from a 1 comma 2. Okay. The equation of locus of a point P such that the distance of P 
from the origin is twice means 2 times the distance of p from a 1 comma 2. So, let us find out. So, now draw the coordinate axis. Say this is x, x dash, y, y dash. This is origin means 0 comma 0 coordinates. Let us take p x 1 comma y 1 point on the locus. Suppose this point is a 1 comma 2. a 1 comma 2. Here given that given distance from origin to p is 2 times the distance from p to a. That means, O p is equal to 2 times p a. Now, O p this O p we can write root of x 1 square plus y 1 square is equal to 2 times root of x 1 minus 1 whole square plus y 1 minus 2 whole square. So, this equals to root of x 1 square plus y 1 square 2 times root of x 1 square minus 2 x 1 plus 1 plus y 1 square minus 4 y 1 plus 4 squaring on both sides. So, that implies x 1 square plus y 1 square equals to 2 square is 4. So, 4 times x 1 square plus y 1 square minus 2 x 1 minus 4 y 1 plus 5. Let us write like this 4 x 1 square plus 4 y 1 square minus 8 x 1 minus 16 y 1 plus 20 equals to x 1 square plus y 1 square. Bring x 1 square plus y 1 square this side. So, we get 3 x 1 square plus 3 y 1 square minus 8 x 1 minus 16 y 1 plus 20 equals to 0. Therefore, the equation of locus of p x 1 comma y 1 is 3 x square plus 3 y square minus 8 x minus 16 y plus 20 equals to 0.